Hey everybody, welcome to this edition of Hal Center. From the studios at Francis Hall High School, I'm Melissa Juris, joined by senior Easton Van Meter, who will be attending St. Charles Community College next fall. I'm doing the A-plus program and will get two years for free. I play tennis and I'm planning on getting my associate's degree in business. For our first story, let's head to Cosley Elementary, where families come together not just to catch up on technology, but to get ahead of it. It's called Tech Fest, the second year in which Cosley has hosted this. We have a reporter on the scene. Hello, my name is Jake Schweitzer, and I am here presenting on Cosley Tech Fest 2016, the biggest event you could possibly think of. All of the presentations were all the hard work and everything they got into these presentations on wide known topics of technology. Hi, I am joined here with Mrs. Armstrong, and I'm going to be asking her a couple of questions about Tech Fest. What do you like most about Cosley Tech Fest? I like that the students are leading the classes and that they came up with all of their ideas on their own. Have you been to any presentations and what were they? I went to the robotics presentation by the Girl Scouts and then I'm in here helping the student now get ready for their presentation. They're having Cosley Tech Fest 2016 is awesome! So back to you in studio something! Bye! Let's head a little further south to Henderson Elementary, where students are learning how to behave on the bus. And we have a reporter on the scene. Hi, this is Declan, Eagle reporter at Henderson Elementary, where the bus slot three kids learned about our Eagle expectations on the bus. Natalie, what did you learn today? I learned to be safe, respectful, and responsible. We learned to sit seat to seat, back to back, and hands in our lap. We're always learning here at Henderson Elementary. Now back to the studio. Now let's head over to our little sister school, Francis L. Middle. We already knew how musically talented the Junior Viking Band is, but did you know what they're doing for those in our community? They're doing some good. Honor Flight is a program that flies our military heroes to Washington, D.C. to visit the monuments that honor their sacrifices. At Francis Howell Middle School, we honor our veterans through a Veterans Day ceremony. But really, it is also instilling the idea of showing them respect every day that matters. The entire school pulled together to raise money with Penny Wars and other activities. The money raised totaled $7,200, and this sent 12 veterans to Washington, D.C. And when the heroes returned home, we wanted to have a welcome worthy of their heroism and sacrifices to our country. Honor is not bought, it is earned, and we at Howell Middle think they deserve it. For Hal Center, I'm Keely Ablin. It's inspiring to see the appreciative faces of so many of our nation's heroes. That really puts things into perspective. Francis Hall High School got a new perspective this year when our girls varsity basketball team played in the state final four and wrestling finished third. But last fall, the boys soccer team earned its first state championship in the program's history. To have the whole school rallying behind the team was exciting, and to have them win the championship was truly amazing. Hey guys, my name is Kane Katubik, and we have here your soccer state champions. What do you guys think about winning? Yeah. 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 There you have it, you're a soccer state champions. I know the guys play like a team, but they don't have to answer questions like a team. <laughs> <laughs> we'll be right back after these messages. Here at John Weldon, our kids are always showing leadership in the classroom, at recess, and even at home. In fact, they're such great leaders, I just let them run the school. House, that extra recess, I'm getting tired of talking about it. Kathy, E! News today, seriously. Shaw, where's the attendance data? They've got lots of great ideas. Pizza parties every afternoon. Every day is a dress up day extending recesses an extra half hour so they can actually finish the game they started. I mean, no one likes a tie. Mr. Shaw, where's your tie? When you started here, you said I didn't have to wear one anymore. We'll see you in ISS. Oh, no. Being a leader at John Weldon is cooler than the other side of the pillow. Welcome back to Hal Center. This anchoring job has been fun for us. We got our start anchoring the Viking Report which you can see at fhhstoday.com. After filming our final Viking report, we couldn't leave you without giving you the Howell Center Top 3 list. And for that, we head over to the Early Childhood Center at Meadows Parkway. Take it away. We love our the 
They're so cute. And that's what's happening on this end of the Francis Howe world. We hope you enjoyed this edition of Awesome. For Alyssa Juris, I'm Easton Van Meter. Thanks for watching.